Hello everybody, good afternoon. It's Carletta, welcome back to my channel. Um, I wanted to read something to you today um, for some encouragement for those people that are feeling like God is not listening to you or feeling like, oh, maybe I don't know God or maybe I'm not saved, you know, that kind of stuff. Stuff that goes through a Christian's mind all the time um this is out of first john the gospel according to john um chapter i'm going to start at verse six and it said there was a man sent from god whose name was john this man came for a witness to bear witness of the light that all through him might believe. He was not the light, but was sent to bear witness of the light. That was the true light, which gives light to every man coming into the world. He was in the world and the world was made through him and the world did not know him. He came to his own and his own did not receive him. But as many as received him, to them he gave the right to become children of God. To those who believe in his name, who were born not of blood, nor of the will of the flesh, nor of the will of a man, but of God. I just want to say to anyone out there today that if you're struggling um, in your Christian walk and um, you know, and if you fall short, just get before the Lord, talk to him, cry out to the Lord. Um, read your Bible. <laughs> um, I want to encourage you that when you accepted Jesus, the Lord gave you the right to become a child of God. He, he came in and, and now he's, he's living in your heart and he loves you. And even when we sin and we fall short, we can ask for forgiveness and the Lord to forgive us. Most of the time, we're the ones that's always beating ourselves up when we mess up. The Lord doesn't beat us up. And once we repent and, and we get before the Lord and we pray, repent means to turn away from doing something that, that you know is wrong. For some people, um, you might have to go through therapy or, or classes or whatever because everybody's sins and shortcomings are different and the Lord deals with us different. I wanna encourage you to, to pick up your cross and keep going, to hold on to Jesus with everything you got. Don't give up. Um, falling short is something that we all do. Um, we all have a sin nature, but because Jesus died on the cross for our sins, we don't have to stay in that place. We can call on the Lord and we can um, seek his face and ask him to set us free and to forgive us and, and keep going in your walk. Don't give up. Um, and for those that are going through hard times, um, hold on to Jesus. Don't give up. Hold on to the Lord. Be encouraged, my brothers and sisters. Jesus overcame the world. And because he overcame, you are more than a conqueror through him. Um, you are more than a conqueror through Christ Jesus, our Lord. Be blessed today. Remember to encourage each other. Um, everywhere you go, you see another Christian, you encourage them. Um, stay blessed and read your Bible. And remember to keep looking towards the sky. Jesus is coming. Have a good day.